guys, welcome to part 23. Last episode, Karina decided that we should go climb the top, the master, top mastery, whatever. It's Gherkin. So we're just doing that right now. Ooh. Wait, a long time ago. It was a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. How come I haven't noticed? I demand reasons. <gasps> Lucario! That is true. I love you, Lucario! Wait, Lucario's like four foot tall. That means I'm actually a good sized child instead of, you know, like a 12 year old. Oh. Okay, what's this one? Who are you people? Cool. I think that one hurts more, the heavier they are. Sig According to her, Professor Sigma is a quitter. Alright, let's go look at... User makes a swift attack on the target legs, which lowers the target speed stat. Uh, considering... Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna give that to you. Yeah, totally. Yeah, totally. The double kick kicks twice in succession using both feet, 60 damage, or 65 and it lowers your speed. So I'm gonna have to go with double getting rid of double kick. And ta-da! I mean, I, I kind of consider this, but... Eh. I think it'd be better just to take the time to use swords attack. Sword stance. However you want. But why is there a brick wall here? Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Oh. It's both Lucario's. This is just about as dramatic. I really love this place. You just ruined the dramaticism of it. If I'm here with my Pokemon and looking at the wide open sky above, all my worries disappear. And I feel like I can do anything. You're still doing the roller skates, thing. Thanks for coming all the way up here. It was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring is handed over, because that's the most dramatic and it would seem the best on the movie picture. What? Never mind. Something about making sure we never forget that Sarah height sights as high as the sky. And here it is, your very own Mega Ring! It's in the shape of a bracelet, so it's super easy to wear. That's convenient. I was just hoping it was an actual ring. Next, equip the Mega Ring on his left wrist. Well, thank you. Good thing you need that clarification. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone and try battling with it. Your Pokemon will surely answer the call of the Mega Ring. Hmm, Lucario, what's wrong? Goof. Lucario, you sure? You want to battle alongside that chair? Yes! I accept you! I accept you! I'm a bit shocked that some traveling trainer seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Yeah, I'd, I'd feel pretty dissed by that too. He was something special. So what do you say, trainer? Will you and Lucario battle against me and my Lucario? Lucario and Lucario battle. It'll be nothing short of riveting. They both have Lucario Knight in hands. So how about we get this show on the road? Yeah. I can feel Lucario's passion. Perhaps it's just that it doesn't want to lose the other Lucario. That may be that it's just on the same wavelength as you. What's going on? Focus. Ready, Lucaria? Focus. Let's get all we got! You're challenged by successor Corina. Successor Corina sent out Lucaria. Go, Luca! I only get this, Lucaria. This could be very bad. All right. Max, what are you doing? Where my hat is at? What? How do I use a Mega Stone? Fight. Okay, look at Lucario. He is this. Ooh. Okay. Does this take a turn? Normal. Wah! Normal. Wah! Normal. Wah! 
Okay, look at him. He is a no. Wait, hold on. Bone rush, bone rush. Start with power up punch, finish with bone rush. Push the button. Oh my goodness. That is that is really cool. Sweet. Mega Lucario. That is awesome. Punchy. <laughs> wow. Okay. You defeat Successor Karina. What an incredible bond you have. What amazing power. It's only because I moved first. If you used the same move, you probably would have killed me. What an explosive battle. I can tell you that both Mega Lucario didn't hold anything back. You didn't even get to move. With strong bonds like that, you should have any uh, trigger in your Pokemon's Mega Evolution. Goof. I think it'd be best if you took that Lucario along with you on your journey. I accept. It's quite apparent that you two make a truly incredible team. I love you, Lucario. Goof. Absolutely, yes. Yes. Got a Lucario! Dream Pokemon. How about Awesome Sauce? As long as Pokemon trainers have the kindness of care to care for each other and give each other courage, the world will be full of smiles. Goof! I like how they all say Groof. <laughs> Drip Blue, carry me off this! Jump! Swan dive! Okay, fine. So let's look at something. Pokemon... Lucario 40 That's kind of nice. Eh. Yeah, I like that. Let's see. Cool. I'm not sure if it's what I'm going for. Hold on, what's his ability? That's pretty neat. The fact that he's not that far off from everyone else is pretty great. Okay, next thing we gotta do is, now that we can Mega Evolve, go to, where is it, in here, give to Venusaur, yeah, and, laser command, give to you, yes, okay, let's see, and then we got, no one can really make any use of that. No one can really make any use of that. No. No. Well, they can always use that, but no. Um, no. No. No, okay. So since that was awesome, let's go pick a fight with someone and... Actually, Venusaur, you'll be up. I want to show you guys Venusaur's Mega Evolution. What am I supposed to do with myself now? Wee, wee, wee! Hello, giant Lucario. Wee. Okay. Okay. I really hope Serena get like. Okay, I actually hope I meet a lot more people with the little Mega Vision rock, whatever. Because I don't want it to be just me running around with it. I want everyone to have it. Everyone should be running around with incredibly powerful mystical energies. Yeah. Thank you. Tiana must have stole it from you. Okay. What? You should use this. Sweetest deals! Oh, wait a second. I got a problem now. When I think about it, it's kind of amazing how a person like you came to Kalos and ended up traveling. It's like destiny in a way. I just remembered. What? I'm going to be traveling again. Yeah, so? I got all six of my Pokemon. I don't want to use any of them. Okay, now here's the next problem. Summary. That's cool. No, I want to see... Okay, fine. 
Water pulse. Compared to surf, that thing's nothing. So here's the problem. I'm going to have to think about it a little bit. Do I want to give up? Or do I want to put surf in place of water pulse? I'm going to throw a bunch of TMs to my Pokemon and think about this, so just give me a second. Just kind of see what everyone can do now that they're evolved. Alright, I'm gonna give him Surf. Yeah, T yeah. Yeah. The only problem with the HMs is it's a complicated process to get rid of them. So I'm gonna give you T90. 90 versus 60. Knowing water types, you'll probably later on in life learn like um Hydro Pump. But Hydro Pump's incredibly inaccurate. Maybe waterfall. I don't really have any faith in water shuriken, so Surf seems to be the best bet. Yeah! Okay, sorry about that. Let's keep this party rolling. Hello! Uh, you're welcome. Ditto. Who are you? Who? Um, she wants to give me a Lapras for nothing, so I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna get that Lapras. I got Lapras! Sure, just, you know, casually give me a really rare Pokemon. Go out and swim to your heart's content. Yep. Yep, yep. Really not a bad moveset. Or ability, actually. Laprases are pretty cool. I mean, I personally don't use one. But, I mean, in the big scheme of things, they're cool. Alright, let me put it back and then come back here. Alright, I'm back. Where to go, where to go, where to go? What's in here? Might as well just do a quick little check. No, get away from me. I'm just gonna skip it. Wait, ah, oh, I just realized what? I haven't caught any wingle. Oopsie doodle. Better not make that mistake again. Alright there, I just want to show you his Mega Evolution, then Blaziken's Mega Evolution, and then we'll get back to training Lucario. Because we need to get him back up. We need to get him up with everyone else. Ah! No, I don't wanna. I don't- what the? Tauros! Alright, let's show you that Mega Evolution. Fight. Mega! Sorry, I love this. Yeah! 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 Um, I don't know if I have any really moves that can hit him nicely. Oh, well, let's go for it. Bada bing! Now he's a bigger flower monster. Lib! Okay, good. Oh yeah, that's actually going to be kind of powerful. Okay, bag. Last two item. Use. Look, I got nothing to hit you tonight. Ah! I got nothing to hit you nicely. So just submit. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Thank you. Gotcha. Tauros was caught. The most irritating Pokemon in the Safari Zone. Maybe short of Chansey. 
And I just caught him casually. Wow. That's pretty sweet. Tauros' data was added to the Pokedex. After hiring its will to fight by whipping itself with its three tails, it charges at full speed. I don't know about you, but if, when I punch myself while running, it's never got me anywhere. Ooh. Uh, use it all on yourself right No! No, oh power. Ah! Everyone's nagging me! Oh! I want one! Oh, you ain't so cute! Okay, here's my brilliant plan. Which ah! Max, what are you doing? I mean, there's like no restrictions on using it. I can use it as much as I want. Aw, oh, man. I was hoping the whole not being effective thing would work to my favor. Apparently, I'm so awesome now, Ken. Okay, let's check in here quick. Curses! I guess I need an HM save with me anyway. Okay, who's the highest level? Lucario! Alright, so he's gonna have to go to the bank. Actually, wait, no. I wanna show you his Mega Evolution first. By the way, I probably should have said this. Lucario's Mega Evolution... Cool. Lucario's Mega Evolution turns him into... A whatchamacallit. I just lost my train of thought. I'm just gonna hit him like this. So Lucario's Mega Evolution gives him the ability. Wow. So it gives him the ability Adaptability, which doubles Stab, which is pretty great. Lucario, like, Venusaur gives you Thick Fat. It gets Thick Fat, which um, protects against Ice and Fire moves, which is pretty sweet. Blaziken gets Speed Boost, and since I already have Speed Boost, it's a little bit of an advantage, but for those of you who have a normal Lucario, not Lucario, Blaziken, gaining Speed Boost is. Ah, oh, my favorite Pokemon ever. It's pretty cool. Sorry. I keep losing my train of thought because it's a cool Pokemon. Fight. Mega Evolution. Okay. Since it's a Psychic, I'm thinking Low Sweep should be fine. More importantly, it got showed off. That is cool. Why is he standing on one foot? Ouch. But I still get faster. Alright. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ding! Thank you. Gotcha, Slowpoke was caught. Slowpoke is like one of my favorite Pokemon. Just saying. It is no it is always vacantly lost in thought, but no one knows what it's thinking about. It is good at fishing with its tail. This is one theory that I read on the internet that the reason he's so vacant, the vacant in thought all the time, is because Slowpoke is omnipotent. Which is why when Shelder bites onto its tail, it becomes super intelligent because it allows it to focus on it allows it to focus and retain the memories of what it once knew. And then when it becomes Slowpoke, it just latches him onto the here and now, which is why he's smarter, but still kind of vacant. Alright, sorry, let me get the slave and then head back there. Alright, now I'm back. Nope. One more battle. Alright, what is it? Come on. Be something cool. Alright, let's try to actually catch you. Okay, no mega evolution. We're trying to be nice here. So just... One little sweet bot to do it. Oh, what? Quit being such a boss. Okay. Cut. How come I can't just climb over that little ledge? Max video game physics. Okay. Well, uh, okay. But they seem impossible to reach. Come on, people. And yeah, uh, it's impassable. I can't make it. 
That's cool. Let's do something fun. Okay, to do... Mega Ring! Um, old Rod. Max, what are you doing? Nothing. Just seeing something. Just seeing something. Nope. Oh, well. Okay, so Pokemon. Since obviously we can't swim that far, which is kind of silly. To be honest. Greninja! That looks nothing like Greninja. Whoosh. Okay, sorry. So the next episode, let's get across this river and see what lies on the other side. So, see you then.